where to enter a 1098 form in h and r block online hi guys welcome to today's tutorial in this tutorial i'll teach you how you can enter or where you can enter a 1098 form in h and r block online so let's get right into it the first step is to um log in or open up your web browser just like i have done here and then once it's opened up in the search box just go ahead and ask the question which is where to enter 1098 form on hr block and then once you've done that you'll go to this page where you see hr block as an heading and then you'll see the function that hr the um 1098 form does which is to report mortgage interest then below it you see the option where do i enter whatever whatever by the time you open it up you can see a write-off saying what you can do and that is that you can report mortgage interest from the form on schedule e also you must have our paid fund etc so this is just like an instruction showing you how or where you can enter the one zero nine it's form so to go ahead just you know click on that particular option which is use the one zero nine eight form to report mortgage interest and then once you've done it we brought to the page where you see tax information center irs then forms and then the first step is that you have to get the 109 form first and then you can get this by vis visiting any of the tax um offices and once you've gotten it come over here and then read all of this instruction first of all what is the 108 uh, tax form and then this is an instruction or an information on how it says that if your mortgage interest is less than 600 dollars your lender doesn't have to send you this form and then you can just read through the box one box two adopting and then once you're done reading all of this and you fully understood what the form is about you cannot go back to the form using the knowledge you've read from this to fill in the form from reading this form you'll be able to know how you can enter or where you are to enter the m109 form in your block so it is it is basically how to do it i hope this tutorial has been helpful thanks for watching and have a nice day